Okay, we're gonna check out the new pool heater. Sorry, it's so dark outside. Propane tank, there's the heater mounted on the side of the house here. So I just put two screws. I know I got a little piece of tin foil, it's a tin foil hat. Um, it's running at 101 degrees. The pool is 60, but I have it on eco mode right now. If I turn it to full, it'll go to 128 degrees. I just think that's too much of a temperature rise. Um, the way I'm feeding this, it has to have water pressure to turn on. So I'm actually using this pool pump, but the way I did it was I just hooked it up to the discharge hose. I know you can't see, I'll try to turn on a flashlight, but I hooked up to the discharge hose and there's the hose going in and discharging out and then it goes up to the heater and then this is the hose coming back. I just wanted to get this going to see if it would work um, and it does work and out of this green hose is the discharge which is about oh well, now it's 99 degrees now watch when I put this on full hopefully you can hear that change um, up here the reason I did this tin foil it was getting too hot back here it's still pretty hot right here there's a lot of heat coming off over here and around so if you look this is not really connected to anything it's just kind of venting out that top so it's coming out these sides and up here so I don't know if this wall is gonna be okay or if I gotta put a plate on the back but we just switched it over to full mode and the highest it's gone for me is 128 degrees right now it's running at 124 but uh, I've got everything turned up to max and I'll see how long this propane last. I think it's gonna last about maybe three hours at the most. And my pool is 60 degrees, so we'll see what it gets up to. Let me grab the thermometer. Let's see, there it is, right at 60. So we'll check it again tomorrow and see where it's at. I'm definitely not leaving this run overnight because uh, I don't want to wake up to a burnt down house. But that's a pool heater. This one, it's at 126 now. This one runs off 2D batteries. That's it. All it does is ignite it. That's all it does. It doesn't need any electricity. It says, this one says that it will run continuous. I'll show you the box. This is the Camp Lux. But right here, it says instant and endless. So we'll see what it does. I've been told they only run for 20 minutes and they shut off. And it does say five safety protection, whatever that means, five safety protection. And this one's 110,000 BTUs, four PSI startup. So we'll see how it does. I'll let you know.